Good, Good morning, morning, staff and students. students. You are joining us at Falcon News on WCFE. I'm Carissa from Miss Louder's class. And I'm Joey from Miss Hertzler's class. Today is Friday, September 2nd, 2016. The fifth day of school. school. Today, some of our incredible fourth grade teachers will lead us in a pledge. Please rise for the Pledge of Allegiance. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Fur Falcon Pledge. As, As a Fur Falcon, I pledge to be a responsible member of our Falcon family. I will do my best to score higher than the rest by making good choices and showing respect. It's all up to me. You may be seated. Joey, what kind of weather can we expect today? This morning it is cloudy and 72 degrees. We will have cloudy skies with rain today and we are already at our high temperature for today. It looks like a washout for high school football games. Carissa, what are we having for lunch today? Cheese or pepperoni pizza, fish sandwich, broccoli with cheese, garden salad, applesauce, melon, and the barn today is a baked potato. Now for all the news you need to know. You will follow Friday, Friday's schedule for Connect. First, third, and fifth grade classes will have media. Kindergarten, second, and fourth grade classes will have guidance. According to NCpedia or the North Carolina Encyclopedia, online our state has 35 state parks. Hammocks Beach State Park was established in 1962. It covers about 33 acres and is made up of three areas located in the mainland at Swansboro, the Barrier Islands, Bear Islands, and Huggins Islands. Hammocks Beach began, a pri began as a private park for African Americans in 1952. Up until that time, during segregation, African Americans in North Carolina were in excluded from access to North Carolina's coastal beaches. New York Dr. John, John Sharp purchased the Bears Island as a vacation refuge in 1914 and donated the state's Black Educator Organization and the North Carolina Teacher Association, or NCTA. The loggerhead sea turtle is found on the island between mid-May and late August. Female loggerheads come ashore at night to nest above the high tide line weighing from 150 to 300 pounds. The females nest every three or four years, laying up to six nests a year. Nests range from 10 to 20 inches deep and often contain 120 eggs. Visit Hammocks Beach State Park sometime. We hope you have enjoyed learning more about North Carolina's state parks this week. Today, all of our kindergarten students are officially here. We, we you are officially here, a part of our Falcon family now. Let's all help our kindergarten friends out when we, they need it in the hallway and cafeteria. That's right, and many of our kindergarten parents are attending a boo-hoo breakfast right now in the media center. I guess some, of, some moms and dads get emotional about their kids starting kindergarten. Oh well, we are happy to have all our little kindergartners here now. This morning we have bus evacuation drills. Second grade at 9.20. 3rd grade at 9.30, kindergarten at 9.40, 1st grade at 9.50, and 4th and 5th grades at 10 o'clock. Students, with all kinds of drills, the bus drill is for your safety whether you ride the bus every day or only for field trips. Please listen carefully to the bus drivers during the drill today. Today we will have a pep rally in the gym. The first starts at 1.15 and the 3rd and 4th. Third, fourth, and fifth grade pep rally is at two o'clock. Let's find out how we can soar it for this year. Thanks. I would like to give a shout out to my dad, Ben, and Chris at Rashid's Engines. Thanks, Thanks for, for joining us on the Falcon News on WCFE. Signing off. Have a fabulous fifth day of school for Falcons. 